James Webb Space Telescope's first images have been revealed recently. I'll be explaining all those real quick in this video. So let's start. Image number 5. This is the SMACS 0723 Galactic Cluster, also known as the Webb's Deep Field. Webb spied an extremely distant population of galaxies in this image. Galaxies in the foreground distort light and help magnify these faraway objects. The light from those galaxies has been traveling for billions of years. And the amazing fact is that you are looking at this galaxy cluster as it appeared some 4.6 billion years ago. Behind it, however, are some more ancient galaxies. This first image from NASA's JWST is the deepest and sharpest infrared image of the distant universe till date. Image number 4 The Exoplanet Spectrum from WASP 96b Some of the Webb Telescope's most stunning observations won't come from any pretty images. Using instruments called spectrometers, Webb can snoop out what the atmospheres of distant alien worlds are composed of. Some planets, for example, might contain water, methane, and carbon dioxide, which could potentially mean they are habitable worlds. Webb's first spectrum of the gases on an exoplanet comes from vast 96b, known as a hot Jupiter. It is a very high temperature gas giant that zooms around its star at tremendous speeds, taking just 3.4 days for a single orbit. NASA's JWST has captured the distinct signature of water along with evidence for clouds and haze in the atmosphere surrounding a hot, puffy gas giant planet orbiting the distant sun-like star. The observation, which reveals the presence of a specific gas molecules based on tiny decreases in the brightness of precise colors of light, is the most detailed of its kind till date, demonstrating Webb's unprecedented ability to analyze atmospheres hundreds of light years away. Image number 3 The Southern Ring Nebula This is a type of object called a planetary nebula. These are vivid shells of gas and dust expelled into space by a dying star. This well-known planetary nebula is some 2000 light years from us. The dimmer star at the center of this scene has been sending out rings of gas and dust for thousands of years in all directions. And NASA's JWST has revealed for the first time that this star is clogged in dust. Image number 2 The Stephans Quintet This is a well-known group of galaxies some 290 million light years away. Four of them are relatively close to one another, locked in a cosmic dance of repeated close encounters. With its powerful infrared vision and extremely high spatial resolution, Webb shows never-before-seen details in this galaxy group. Sweeping tails of gas, dust and stars are being pulled out from several of the galaxies due to gravitational interactions. Image number 1 The Carina Nebula Nebulae are some kind of most dazzling regions of space. They are giant clouds of dust and gas, like those formed after a giant star's explosion. They are fertile grounds for new stars to form. Webb captured a view of the colossal Carina Nebula, located some 7.6 k light years away, a place where large stars have already formed. This landscape of mountains and valleys speckled with glittering stars is actually the edge of a nearby young star-forming region called NGC 3322 in the Carina Nebula. Captured in infrared light by the NASA's JWST, this image reveals for the first time previously invisible areas of star birth. The tallest peaks you see here are some 7 light years high. So these are the first ever beautiful images from the 10 billion dollars observatory. Consider subscribing to my channel if you like this video. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.